In today's video I'm gonna show you how to build a Shopify dashboard in Looker Studio. Uh, in order to build a Shopify dashboard in Looker Studio you cannot use native connectors for Looker Studio and uh, you should choose one of the partners connect. In this case I will use uh, Coppler IO uh, to show you how to build a dashboard. You can uh, build a dashboard from scratch but I will use uh, their template and show you how to connect it and uh, modify some metrics. So you see there are some filters for shipping country, sources, financial status and uh, value. Also you see main metrics like total orders, average order value, total customers, total sales and so on. Also you can see breakdown by different dimensions. What interesting can be is your order list where you see uh, the latest order date order status, cancellations, prices, discounts and so on. Uh, below you can see also customer summary, these uh, different uh, statuses, total sales and other values. Below you also can see top selling items, their quantity and their values. This is uh, the first page. If I click next, on the second page you will see cohort analysis uh, uh, where you analyze your monthly cohorts. Also you can see breakdown by a new and returning customers as well as sales by new and returning customers. Uh, Let me uh, jump back on the first page and here I can uh, for sure readjust these uh, charts. Uh, select these charts and make them smaller and move uh, all scorecards above. Uh, these charts I can move below. Uh, what is really interesting can be is to set some kind of targets. For instance, for total sales, we can uh, quite easily add uh, target value using uh, other comparison options and set value 500k. And uh, here I need to click option show as a progress. Now you can see a nice progress bar with our target value showing the difference between uh, our current sales and total sales. So it can be done for other metrics as well. Well, it is one of the dashboards that you can use based on Shopify data and it is dashboard template so you don't need to do it from scratch. Let me show you another dashboard also using Shopify data but with, combined with uh, other data sources like ads data and uh, G4 data. It is also can be useful for your e-commerce store. And here you can see your uh, your ad spend and also it shows a nice funnel for impressions, clicks, users and new customers. Also you see it's joint uh, data from ads channels, uh, J4 and Shopify data to see new customers, uh, acquisition costs and so on. If I scroll down you see trends for AOV, uh, CPM, CPC, users and so on. If you want to replicate these dashboards, uh, let me show you how to do it. You need to navigate on Coupler IO website. The link will be in the description below. And here you need to click uh, get started for free, connect your data. You can use a free plan to connect your Shopify stores data and uh, you don't need any credit cards to pull data from Shopify. Uh, so let's imagine I already sign in uh, into Coupler IO. And here I need to select importers and uh, click uh, add importers. Here I need to select uh, my data source. Uh, it will be a Shopify and uh, destination will be Looker Studio. So below you see uh, two dashboards that I showed you a couple of minutes ago. You can preview this template from here 
and uh, click try this report to replicate your data you need to authorize your Shopify account Looker Studio as your destination to replicate uh, the dashboard templates and you just need to follow uh, the instructions uh, so I hope this video was useful if, if you want to build Shopify dashboard from scratch and need my help I will leave links to my booking page below uh, where you can uh, book a free intro call with me and we figure out your needs have a great day